<laughs> oh. <laughs> this is Ollie and this is Penny. Say hello guys. Hi. Hey everybody, welcome back to my YouTube channel. My name is Danny Ritzloff, also known as Moonhawk. If this is your first time visiting my YouTube channel, welcome. And to returning subscribers, thank you so much. I appreciate your support. So I'm really excited to share this vlog because I love gardening. That's what it's about. Community gardens. It runs in my family. My grandfather had a reputable farm in Detroit and it was like an urban garden and he was highlighted in the news and in the papers back then. I think it just runs in my blood. I just love growing things. I love community effort. Do you like gardening? So today I'm really excited to go explore a community garden in Santa Monica, California. Maybe we'll see something pretty or it'll be fun. All right, Santa Monica Community Garden, here I come. There's definitely things here that I have no idea what they are, but there's a lot of really pretty things. Like, I don't know what kind of cactus this is, but like what these are, what are they? And I see these around California sometimes, but I have no idea what they are, but they're so pretty. Greens, more tomatoes, spinach, kale. These are beets. Beets, beets, growing in the ground, beets. Every single person here pays $100 a year. It's kind of like a dream come true for most people in this city. And you can really tell that they put a lot of love into these and that they're constantly taking care of them. But there's this little vortex of like good garden vibes over here. I'm starting to notice all these beautiful things growing that I didn't now that the sun is out. Like even these strawberries. So I could be wrong, but this looks like like some dinosauric, gigantic spinach. I don't know. Ooh, sunshine. I know that the plants are feeling all this sun that's coming out behind the clouds right now because I'm feeling it, and there's just a good energy coming from this place. I can't explain it, but it's so nice. of romaine I as a gift. <laughs> so as I was about to leave, I got offered some lettuce as a gift. Thank you so much. You're such a sweetheart. Well, have a beautiful day. I appreciate you. Keep up the good work. It looks beautiful.
Okay, so that was really fun. You guys, I really enjoyed that. I just wanted to go check it out and see if it was even open and I got invited in twice by two different gardeners who were there. This one in Santa Monica apparently has been around for years. So Chris, the guy who let me into the garden, because there is a gate and there is a lock. He actually told me that there's like a five to six year wait now on this garden. If you hear about a new one coming up in your neighborhood, you might wanna be one of the first people to get a plot. If you guys can find a community garden near you, I highly suggest going to check it out. Maybe there's even a plot open that you might be able to use. I have seen community gardens in places like San Francisco or Seattle, Washington. I really hope that other big cities start doing the same thing with their community and with their land because it's a really good way to get to know each other and get to know the earth, especially when you're stuck in a big city, you know, it's hard to, sometimes you forget where you come from. So maybe this will inspire you to go in your backyard and tend to your garden or even maybe contact your local community organizers. You can go be a part of it. So the more that cities develop buildings and different types of things around town, there is going to be less nature, there is going to be less trees, less gardens, and a lot of these cities are taking initiative to kind of make sure that they bring the life back to the city, even though they're paving everything with concrete and building skyscrapers, they're still trying to bring nature into this city, which is kind of amazing. It's really awesome when cities incentivize, um, you know, having beautiful things to look at or having a garden to walk by or a garden to actually tend to yourself. This is like the future of city living. All of your friends have a community plot and everybody who lives in a big city that wishes they had a garden can finally have one. This is awesome! Oh, I love gardening. If you guys found this informational or entertaining to watch, please feel free to like or comment the video. You can subscribe to my channel and all the links to my other social media platforms will be in the description below. Until next time, say bye!